Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm feeling very weirdly energised today, I'm not quite sure why. I was outside for a little bit doing some gardening with my dad, so maybe because I had some fresh air instead of just being inside all the time. Anyway, I hope you are all staying well and good. This is going to be the last video on the infinitive versus the gerund. In a moment I'm going to explain what I'd like you to do today. But first, I'd like to let you know that tomorrow on my Instagram, I'm going to be doing a big quiz to review all of these examples we've looked at during the week. So for those who don't already follow me, you can find me at Your Sassy English Teacher. So go ahead and add me now. Anyway, moving on to what we need to do today. I've got again four examples for you, um, but this time I'm only going to give you the basic simple verb, and you have to decide whether to change it into the gerund or the infinitive. Just like with the other videos, I'm gonna give you one minute exactly to have a look at those and try and do as many as you can. So, your one minute starts now. Okay, time's up, welcome back. Let's go over the four examples together. Example number one, I hope mm, as soon as possible. The verb I gave you was leave. So did you think it was I hope to leave or I hope leaving as soon as possible was the correct answer? Well, let's find out. The correct answer should be I hope to leave as soon as possible. So after hope, we can use the infinitive. Next one, you need to practice mm, more than once a week. So did you choose to speak or speaking? Okay, so it should be you need to practice speaking, so the gerund, the ing form, more than once a week. Number three, I want mm, a thriller tonight. This one should be I want to watch. So after want, we use the infinitive. And the final one, are you offering mm, me? Are you offering helping me or to help me? What do you think? It should be, are you offering to help me? So here we are using the infinitive. Okay guys, so that's everything. Thank you so much for watching this very short series on the gerund and the infinitive. I hope it was useful. Like I said, there's gonna be a big quiz on my Instagram tomorrow, so don't forget to follow me so you can participate in that. Thank you for everything, and I will see you guys next week with another video. Thanks very much, bye.